first grade friends. Are we ready for some new math? All right, today we're going to be adding and subtracting tens. So that's what we're gonna be doing all this week. Now, we've added and subtracted before with maybe we've added two plus six, which we know is eight. And we've also subtracted maybe 10 minus four, which we know is six. But now we're going to be adding, today just adding, we're going to be adding bigger numbers, numbers with two digits. So if you look at this problem, it says John uses 20 blocks, then he uses 20 more. How many blocks does John have in all? So I'll read it two more times for you. John uses 20 blocks, he uses 20 more. How many blocks does John use in all? Okay, so what could we do to figure out how many blocks he has all together? So in all, when we see it says, John, how many blocks does John use in all? So in all is telling us that we need to add them together. So 20 blocks, then he uses 20 more. Hmm, what could we do in this big empty space to try to figure that out? Well, we could draw a picture, but if we drew 20 blocks and then 20 more, that would be an awful lot of things for us to count in ones. So here's what I want you to think about. We've used 10 sticks before, and if we use 10 sticks, that would be much easier to count by tens than it would be to count by ones. So I pulled out, oh, well, there's lots of crazy stuff in here, our old crayon bin. So I'm going to take out some crayons because I don't have my 10 sticks. So there's my two. So that would be John uses 20 blocks. So let's see, 10, 20. Okay, there's the block to use. Then he uses 20 more. So I would need to pull out how many more crayons? Right, two more. So he used 20 blocks and then 20 more blocks. We want to put them together and see how many blocks he used all together. Can you tell me? What do you think? Hmm, hopefully you said 40. So this is how you would have figured that out. 10, 20, 30, 40. We counted by tens. That was way easier to count by tens than it would have been to count by ones to add up all those blocks. Okay, we're gonna come back over here to our screen and see what our next question is. Okay, whoops, sorry about that guys. Okay, so here's some more balls. Now they're in groups of 10 because it's easier. You could sit here and count all those balls, but it could take a long time or you could get mixed up and then you would come up with the wrong answer. So we're definitely gonna try counting by tens instead. Oh my goodness, I keep doing that to you guys, sorry. Okay, let's look at the red. How many red balls are there? It's a group of 10. So 10 balls and, okay, there's not just 10 here, there's two groups. So the two groups would be, right, 10, 20. So 10 red balls and 20 more balls is how many balls? What do you think? You, can you count by tens for me and see how many are there? 30, right, 10, 20, 30. So 10 plus 20 equals 30. So we had 10 balls and then we are adding together 20 more. So 10 plus 20 equals 30. So here, they did use our 10 sticks. So the first one has how many? Right, there's only one. So one, 10, and how many are here? Right, two. 
So one ten and two more tens is how many tens? Or we could say 10 plus 20 is how many? 10, 20, 30, or three tens. So one ten and two more tens is how many? Three tens. So three tens all together, okay? Okay, let's try this one. How many tens? Right here, how many tens? Good, so two tens and how many tens here? Two tens and four tens is how many tens all together? Two tens plus four tens equals, right, six tens. Or we could also say 20 plus 40 equals, let's see, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60. So 20 plus 40 equals 60. Or we could say two tens and four tens is six tens. So there's different ways we could say it. Okay, let's try this one, you ready? So we have red balls and then we have yellow balls. So, hmm, let's see if we could add this. So how many balls do you think are here? Right, 20, 10, 20, 20 balls. And now let's look at the yellow balls right here. How many are there? Count by tens. There's three groups, so 10, right, 20, 30. 20 balls plus 30 balls is how many all together? Let's see. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50. So 20 plus 30 equals 50 balls. Would you wanna count those all one at a time? Probably not, it would take a very long time. This way is much faster. Okay, so here are more 10 sticks. So how many 10s are first? Let's see how many are here. How many 10s? Right, two 10s. And three 10s is how many 10s all together? One, two, three, four, five, five tens. So two tens plus three tens is five tens. Or we can say 20, because there's 20 ten, 20 ones here, plus three is 30. Three tens is 30. So 20 plus 30 is 10, 20, 30, 40, 50. Okay. So that was a little bit tricky, but we're gonna do this for the rest of the week, so it'll get a little bit easier, but when we're counting by tens, it goes much quicker than counting every single one of those little balls. So thank you for doing math with me today, and I'll see you tomorrow. Have a great day. Love you, miss you, bye.